Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Liz Collin. Voices of concern were heard on the other side of the Mississippi tonight after the acquittal of a Twin Cities police officer who killed a driver during a traffic stop. A jury yesterday found Officer Geronimo Yanez not guilty on all three counts related to the shooting. In Minneapolis tonight, a group marched in solidarity along Hennepin Avenue after a rally was held earlier in Loring Park. It was organized by a mayoral candidate for the city of Minneapolis. Nina Moyni was there for this latest rally and march. Nina? Hi, Liz. The protesters blocked traffic along some busy downtown intersections and protested briefly outside the downtown police precinct. Minneapolis police followed along the entire way trying to keep protesters and drivers safe. About white lives. Your lives are treated like they matter every single day. So what about them? An estimated 200 people started the evening listening to speakers in Loring Park. We all speak the same emotions. That's our language. This was the second night protesters took to the streets demanding justice for Philando Castile. But this event was titled Solidarity March Against Police Violence and White Silence. So we're going to have to put more pressure on the system. And we're going to have to put pressure on our predominantly white churches to start for those who profess Christ, for those who claim to be people of faith. We got to put the pressure on them to prove it. After about an hour of dialogue, the group marched through Hennepin Avenue, Come on. blocking intersections and a light rail stop along Fifth Street. We're going to lift up Miss Castile so that we send positive energy her way, y'all. Holding a moment of silence for Philando Castile, hoping their actions will speak louder than words. Minneapolis police did not make any arrests tonight. The entire protest lasted from about 5 o'clock to 8.30. There is another demonstration planned tomorrow outside of St. Anthony, Anthony Police Department. All right. Thank you, Nina.